The most remarkable moment in life is when you meet the person who makes you feel complete. The person who makes the world a beautiful and magical place. The person with whom you share a bond so special that it transcends normal relationships and becomes something so pure and so wonderful that you can't imagine spending another day of your life without them. For Max and Heather, that happened about six years ago at St. Mary's. And now, here they are sealing the deal and making it official. Heather, I'm in awe of all of your accomplishments, and I know all of our family is also. Life hasn't always been easy for us, and I'm so thankful for our crazy family. We have always been able to pick one another up when we are down, and we have been able to rise above and be better together. And I hope you know how proud I am of you. But I'm even prouder that you have opened up yourself to love and finally found someone who loves you unconditionally and can be the calm to your crazy. Marriage is perhaps the greatest and most challenging adventure of human relationships. No ceremony can create your marriage. Only you can do that. Through love and patience, through dedication and perseverance, through tenderness and laughter, through learning to forgive learning to appreciate your differences, and by learning to make the important things matter and to let go of the rest. By the power vested in me by the state of West Virginia, it is my honor and delight to now pronounce you man and wife. You may kiss your bride. Max, you have made my sister happier than I've ever seen her before. I love watching you guys joke back and forth with each other. I love the way that she smiles when she is with you and how you both accept one another for who you are. I wish you a lifetime of adventure together and I know God has so many plans for you both. I love you both so much. So let's raise our glasses and toast to love, laughter, and happily ever after. Max and I have been friends for a very long time. When Max told me about Heather, I kind of knew that things were going to wind down to a close because you don't see people that happy that often. And he did a really good job with Heather. I don't think he could do much better at all. So, you know, we've had some really great times, be it drinking driving games, Max playing chicken with a moving vehicle and losing multiple times. Um, but I'm just so glad to see him so happy and to make someone as happy to be with him. So congratulations so much. I don't have an appropriate toast, unfortunately, but I wish you guys the best of luck forever and always. So yeah, to Max and Heather, guys. Yeah.